know and I know everything happens in South Florida. And if you were lucky enough to be here some 50 years ago, you would have been part of one of those rare where were you when moments. The cavalcade of stars featured the likes of Frank Sinatra, Sammy Davis Jr., Joey Bishop, and a host of other entertainers. But few made as big a splash as the Beatles' appearance on The Ed Sullivan Show in February of 1964, live from the Deauville, where they spent the week. Miami Beach City Commissioners are set to discuss the fate of the historic Deauville Hotel. Officials are looking into demolishing the building after it was declared unsafe. The hotel closed back in 2017 following an electrical fire. Hotel on Miami Beach has shut down after fire raced through its electrical room overnight, sending guests packing. And now the hotel is supposed to host a big salsa conference starting tomorrow. But is it going to happen? I can't see What's next? Some even camping out in the lobby while the hotel worked to reaccommodate their guests at other properties. So what caused the fire? Apparently a portable air conditioning chiller. What is going on my kings and queens? I hope you're having a good day because I am too. Now this is going to be an exclusive video. I literally explore from the basement all the way to the roof, one of the most famous hotels in Miami, Florida. It is called the Deauville Beach Resort. It was designed by Melvin Grossman and built in 1957, boasting more than 500 rooms. This fancy all-inclusive resort featured a gigantic swimming pool, a beauty salon, restaurants, shops, a radio station, an ice skating rink. The Mimo Star Resort was eventually was named Hotel of the Year. Now, what really put the Deville on the map was the famous Beatles performed here in 1964. And the best thing about this is that this is the first time that they ever came to the United States. The first place was in New York. They went to the S. Sullivan Show and a week later they went to Deauville Resort. The show was watched by an estimated 70 million people and was repeated on September 20th, 1964. Now, not only that the Beatles played here at the Deauville Hotel, but we also had JFK, Richard Nixon, Sammy Davis Jr., Frank Sinatra, we also had Louis Armstrong, Aretha Franklin, we had all these amazing celebrities come here and also played as well. Now entering at this hotel, I have no idea where they played at. But I literally, as my first video, my first clip, I actually was standing right where the Beatles played. Now, if you guys are new to my channel, like and share, and also hit that notification button so you won't miss any of my videos. I hope you guys enjoy this one, and I see you guys in the next one. Pablo in the house. We got 
Kathy, someone behind me. She don't be seen. We got, we got Ieni and my daughter. Whoa. But we are going to check out right now this abandoned hotel. And it's real close fast. Don't yell, so. Check this out. Talking loud because I got to talk loud for the wind. Look at this right here. They got some chairs over there. As you can tell, they got chairs already standing up. So, I think there is only a, an entrance. And it's just going to be right here. So, I'm going to go in first. So, I'm going to see if I can go through here, walk over here, and see how I could enter into that building. But look how many, there's like so many floors out here. Oh my god, if you can see the view from what I'm seeing here. This place is humongous. The water. You know me, I always gotta check out the water. If it's cold or if it's warm. Yeah, I know. That's what I always do. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Woo. You okay? See right there? What are you looking at, guys? It's that abandoned hotel. I don't know how, but I'm gonna find a way to get in there. It's hot. How are you gonna do it? Oh, it's warm. Can you guys see the the water? If you can, comment down below. Say yes. Hopefully, it's not a bad quality. Got you ready. At the beach. Go ahead, go ahead, Zoe. No, I don't Okay, yeah, yeah. Tomorrow then. Sometimes you you just gotta get out of your way and just enjoy life. Living in New York, it is tough. You know, you always gotta watch your back because you don't know what's gonna happen to you. You know who's behind you. Confessing you know. <laughs> the what? Confessing or something over there? Yeah. You know, New York is very dangerous. You know. I have a daughter. I want to make sure she get home safe. You know. I try to make sure. You know, we come back to. You know, we could come back here in, to Miami, in Florida. Any part in Florida. You still live in Florida. That is my goal. I do like the west side, the west coast too, but all my family's here, so I might, just, might as well just come over here. The bill, guys. Love you, sister. So door here. What happened to the door? Is locked? Yeah, it has a bolt. Oh, See, the bolt yeah. It's creepy. Oh my gosh. No, maybe I'll <laughs> Some guy on a bike. I hope he don't go anywhere. So, hey, I'm on camera right there. Shoot. Definitely on camera, guys. I'm a little bit scared. Because of the wind. Kathy, what is that noise? Huh? What is that noise? The frogs? Oh, is there frogs? That's a, uh, yeah. yeah. That is a big one. But they are there. And that's the pool area. That's a pool right there? Yeah, that's a pool. Okay. I'm scared. Why am I here? There's nothing that way. Nothing? Okay. Oh, the doors are locked. I don't know. The punch is right there. I see light over there. They can see the people. They gotta put the lights on. Let's go check this door. Uh, we are trying our best to find something. There's lights. See, the lights are coming from outside. Yeah. One more way to find out. No. No, that's from outside. See here from this side, guys. Right there, the door in the floor. Oh shit. You see that mess? It's destroyed. Yeah. Wow. That's crazy. Look, yeah, baby, this is dangerous. Look, the yeah. ceiling is dropping. Yeah. Yeah, we definitely. Well, at least. I know. Let's see. This door is open. Well, that one is open, but it's yeah. like locked. Maybe through here. Oh, look, window open. Right here. Right here, sorry. Right there. Oh, window? Yep. I That's my way in. That's the way in. Yep. Okay. 
Yo, you're crazy that going through there. That's what we do all the time. Well, I do all the time. Is he a seven or six guy this right here? Nah. No, that should be good. Uh, so we actually find a way here. That's the entrance. So somebody actually came here and broke it and explored this chair right on the floor. So, there's a way in. Now, I know a good spot. I just gotta probably wake up early in the morning and come here. I bring my drone shot just in case. But I think the best time to do is right now at night time. It's fine. Yeah, I put it big. So as you can see, I got my lab mic here. So I'm using the mic that is installed right now, just for now, on the camera. But once I go inside to the building, uh, to the hotel, then I'm gonna turn my lab mic on. I'm just gonna record all night until something happens. But I am not by myself today. I am with my nephew. We got Tico Hector in the house. It's right there, he's chilling. You probably can see them in the White Hill Mansion. Uh, so yeah, we're actually walking right now. To the hotel, and we're gonna go inside and explore every single floor. We are hoping that they do have uh, something, furniture or something, to keep us active and, and you know, explore more. Now, it is, what time is it right now? And you know me, when I go to explore, on the location i make sure i go there and i'm not gonna miss it but as you guys can see right now it's 12 55. but that being said we're gonna go inside check the place out uh hopefully something dope happens in there some crazy activity that's what we're hoping for and uh, that's it let's get it wish us luck all right what's going on guys we finally made it i'm here with my nephew we are actually inside of the hotel. Right behind me is the stage. Now, I do not have my night vision camera, but I'm gonna use this for now. Just explore certain things. I'm gonna use my flashlight. Right down there is literally where um, the main entrance. The hotel is this way. I don't wanna go this way because this is a whole different section. I gotta go over there. Look, it's my reflection. I gotta make sure because I don't know who's here, who's not. So, I don't know. Um, I don't think nobody's here. You heard that? This place could be haunted. They are gonna demolish this abandoned hotel, the DeVille Hotel. Certain things here are gonna just come down and get destroyed. So we have to be careful. There are gonna be sounds that we might think something else, but 100% sure that it's probably the building already getting destroyed. But I am right now at the main entrance where I believe this is the stage where um, the Beatles played at. Um, we're not gonna do too much. I don't wanna go over there, go over there, it's the hotel. You heard that? Huh? So I'll be right back. The ceiling, most of all the stuff here don't have ceilings, just the pipe. So we gotta be careful with things like this that might fall on top of our head. We are in good hands. I'm happy that we are here. I'm happy that we're actually gonna have a video made up. So that's one of the good things here. Now, I'm only using my panel light. He uses his light, I do have flashlight. But like I said, I do not wanna have too much light happening here. But, uh, oh, what was that? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, you guys show that. Yeah, the sun is somewhere around right here. Let me see, maybe here. There's something here on the middle. Now, 
just in case. They do have cats here. We might run into cats. We have an exit sign here, so I don't know where the sound came from. I hear people talking. There's a bar right outside from the place. Oh, what is this? Things kind of creepy here. Who knows what's this? Yo, if you hear voices, there's people outside. But there's a bar. Ooh. And there is the first floor. But mostly, oh, and there's the stairs. It does says Northeast there. So, we might go into the right place. They do have exercise here too, so. Uh, just like the, the building with electricity, most of the doors here are locked. Like literally, the, there's no handles here. So, this is basically what you're gonna see most of the time. So let's go keep on going up. It's gonna be a workout, I do need it. This one has where the beach is there. So as you could tell, some of the, at the outside building, they have this. There's one bed here. Let's go, baby. Ah, we finally made it <laughs> to the fifth floor. So this part is where the beach is at, of course, obviously. So we checked at least one room out. Let's move on to the second one. As you can see, we only have some bed here. <coughs> we got the bathrooms here. Pretty cool. It's the closet area. You put your stuff here. Oh, look at this. We have the Deville. Another one just like it too. Look how clean the bathroom is. So I don't know how long this thing has been abandoned. Shout out to my sister. She's the one that told me about this. Got a bed here. All lined up. Ready to be vanished. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Make sure I close this. So no good is gonna be the other side. This side might be a little bit better. We have some chairs, nice white chairs here. This might seem like a boring video, but um, like I said, we are, it's one o'clock in the morning. We are being, try to be careful here. Um, see if anything here is haunted. This is my view here from the bed. We have the table, the chair, same beds, same chair. And uh, we turn the light off here so you guys can see the outside so check this out we are in one of the buildings one of the famous buildings in Miami Oh, look at that creepy. 
creepy ass chair in the middle. <laughs> Yo, you guys should see everything clear. But yeah, this is uh, one of the hotels, I believe. That's a nice blue pool there. We got my nephew already checking out what the room's out. Yeah. Sound like a footstep. I saw her like a footstep right behind me. Of one of the stairs? Yeah. So we, we're now walking in the corridor on the fifth floor. Like I said, we were going to check every single floor, but not every single room, because as you could tell, all the rooms are almost the same. My main goal is literally just um, for every floor. Check a couple of rooms, not too much. Bless you, bro. You don't need a match for this. Couple of rooms, um, penthouse, and if there's access on the roof, then we're gonna go to the roof. What do you think? Is this 60s, 70s, maybe? Comment down below if you guys know what year you think this picture looks like. For me, I would say 70s. So if you guys were enjoying this video, please like, subscribe. Oh. I just hate myself. Are you gonna light it towards it too? Hold on. <laughs> now you literally gotta like that button. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new. I usually do ghost hunting, but I love doing it over and exploring too. And if I could get the chance to do some nice buildings, I will. Um, if the place is haunted, I will come back and investigate this place. Um, and that's about it. But we have a lot left to go. And it's only on the fifth floor. I think what we should do is we should like literally just come one f every floor, three rooms, and then just go back up. Yeah. And find those. Or three. just like find out the way it looks interesting, just walk in. Yeah. And go all the way to the top. Is that a to the penthouse. Sleeping. Huh? Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> Al Pacino. This is the Al Pacino floor. Woo! Let's go. That's a nice picture too, man. Damn. Yeah. Oh, that would be nice in my room. But I'm not gonna take it. Oh, look who we have. Nixon. President Nixon. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the President Nixon. Oh, look who we have too. John F. Kennedy. Wow, that's pretty cool. Wow, look. Nixon owes Presley. <laughs> this has to cost a lot of money right there, bro. Dude, I, I mean, I don't know if it's paper, but if it's like the original copy, bro. Now look at this, it's pretty interesting. Wow. Pretty cool. This not might be the best video ever, but to show you this place that is about to be demolished very soon. It's pretty cool. We have the president on the wall. We got Jeff K. Nixon. This is pretty dope. Elvis Presley. Like, what the fuck? The bathroom is nice, bro. It's like untouched. Dusted, but it's untouched. All right, so I just changed my batteries real quick. We did made it to the penthouse. It is different, pretty cool stuff. Um, we have like a little stage type of thing. <laughs> this bed here. <laughs> it says, fuck you. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Got hip hiccups. It says, fuck you. A couple of currents here. I don't recommend it. Yeah, okay. It's cable. So this is the first room that we checked on on the penthouse. We got a couple of clothes here, some fabulosos, some clean supplies. Oh, it's like a battery changing thing. Hey, Hello. Oh, I know. Look at all these faces here. They all have the same face except this one right here. That one. Had a bad day. So red. Shop. The 
something's open. So this is all we have here. Oh, it's pretty cool. And people actually took the time to do this. Look at that wall. And look at the stairs here. Oh, this is pretty cool. Making sure nobody's there. Bro, this is gonna be like a dope ass one. I got a apartment type of thing. The Amo, La Sobotron. Pretty cool. Oh, did you make that? No. Oh, what? I thought you were at 2016, but that would make sense. Oh. Okay. What did I say? Nope, the parking is full. <laughs> <laughs> put the sign up here. Alright, let's go check on the other side. See what I have here. That's probably the same one. It's all kind of cool. Yeah. <clears throat> Depends how it does look different. Now, let's play a guessing game. If you guys heard about the I am the Deville, I am the Deville right now. I did mention a couple of famous people. If you guys can guess how many famous people have lived or came here and rent out the top floors, any type of room, just let me know. I could tell you this, a couple of famous people have done this, done this though. But I don't know why I have a feeling that I am not alone. I mean, well, me and my nephew. I don't know. This is kind of sketch. What's this right here? No, I don't exit. Oh, look at this. I don't know where to go. Okay, they're the same. Let's see what's this. This one looks kind of dangerous, so I'm not gonna stick my head out here. Do a quick look here and there. Let me see what's this. And just another room. Um, there are a couple of doors that are locked, but um, there are not a lot of rooms compared. I feel like all these big rooms take space from what we've seen on the bottom but yeah this is pretty cool let me go get my nephew we're gonna end this video i hope you guys enjoy this one here all right so if you guys are new to my channel subscribe to my channel like and share uh i do most ghost investigation here this is my nephew with us all the way down in miami <laughs> um if you guys are new what i usually do is i um i literally do haunted places on haunted locations like if I feel that this place is haunted I will come back and do an investigation it could take me a year or two I will come back here if the hotel is still here I usually go to hospitals abandoned house uh, mansions with still furniture and stuff like that it's incredible what you can find when you're doing urban exploring like I said if I feel that this place is haunted or any type of location haunted I do night investigations only daytime and nighttime for sure um that being said guys i'm gonna like let you guys go we gotta go i feel like we checked every single floor um um it was incredible i'm happy that we did this i've had dreams about taking this place when my sister told me that space was already abandoned i was like yo i'm going over there let me know let's take something in there Something like a drag. Oh, that's probably the. Yeah, that's okay. That forget it, Almost got spooked there. <laughs> but that's like that's the bag. That's an entrance with the wind, whatever. But yeah, if you guys are new, like, share. Uh, anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you guys enjoy this one. On to the next one. Peace. Peace out, baby. Peace. All right, so we finally made it. We went all the way to the roof. We skipped a few floors. But the last 417, so we're gonna go downstairs. We just need a fresh air. We just wanna enjoy this beauty. Now, look at that. <laughs> that right there is where I am staying at. <laughs> it's where I'm staying at. But look at that view. I'm all the way to the top. I believe this is like the 20th floors. 20th floor that we did today. Check this out. Ah, oh, check this bad boy out. Pretty cool, right? Amazing. Ooh, look at that view. Try not to go too fast to catch every 
This is Miami, Florida. Looking like a little bit like New York City with all this beautiful lights and the water surrounded and the beach and the sand. This thing is amazing. This is what I live for. Stuff like this, I live for. I love, do love doing stuff. Even if we're not getting enough investigation, um, even if we don't feel anything, at least when we come here, we want to make, huh? <laughs> we want to make we want to make sure that we catch every single thing of it. And I'm in another state, I'm from New York City, but I am enjoying this right here. This is something that we live for. Urban explorers and ghost hunters. Uh, does the place feel haunted? There's certain things that I heard, you know, kind of sketch, whatever, but I uh, tried to pay mind to it, so I don't know, maybe it just definitely ignored us. But I just want to show you the view. You guys saw, oh, it looks like a, oh shit. It looks like somebody climb up here. Oh, <laughs> and literally then the whole thing. Probably did, bro. Yeah. They come down. I'm scared. Just jumped. Okay. <laughs> but yeah. So you guys saw earlier that I did my drone shots in the daytime. And this is how beautiful it looks again. I just want to show it off one more time. This is how it looks at night. <laughs> Where we came through. Look how beautiful the stairs here. Now where we're heading right now, I don't know if this is that's the stage where they played at. It's hard, it's kinda hard to tell, but you guys be the judge, you let me know if, if I'm right or wrong. So yeah, basically a lot of stuff that was up here is down here. So basically we have to watch our head so you don't know what could happen. So they got all the crazy chairs here. All that garbage. <clears throat> you in the basement, it's nothing, just flooded. I'm guessing it might be a pool. But put the light down a little bit. I don't want to catch any attraction. Or anybody passing by. Yeah, but this is where the entrance of Miami. We got walkers across the streets. The beach is literally back down there where we're going. So, yep, we got all the trash here. We gotta be careful with whatever is on top of it. Stuff like this, you gotta move to the side because you never know. There's any, every type of furniture, chairs, you name it. You got the, the Napoleon ballroom. So I don't know if this is where all the famous people play the music, the dance hall. It also goes right over there too. So I literally, let me see. You know what, I know what, went inside here. It's locked. Yeah, it's locked. I wonder if it goes through here. We got it? Yep. Oh no, it's the same shit, we've seen it. Same thing? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Or we go this way or go that way. Yep. Yeah, this, is, this is the ballroom. Please. Yeah. It's the entrance of the ballroom. <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, this is the ballroom. This is where we enter. Uh, it's going to be kind of black, but pitch black here. Yeah, telegram for you. Oh, thank you very much. I'm at the Doorville Hotel. Everything you got is tagged. Well, buddy, you know. Bingo! 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 Please. Quiet. No 
Sonny, listen, actually some of these songs could fit you in your fight. One is uh, From Me to You. It's one song they're gonna sing. And another one could fit Cassius, because that song is I Want to Hold Your Hand. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, here are the Beatles. Well, my heart went home when I crossed that room with love. Let's go.